to Muddy Muggy Storytime. I'm Muddy Cat Molly, and we're mighty glad to have Catfish Kathy and Mr. Phil and Miss Renee here today. And you know what? We're so glad to have each one of you here today, too. So, you know, Middle Georgia is a great place to live, and most of the time our weather is really, really good. But this time of the year, there's just always surprises. You know, when the muddy, muggy flooded last month, do y'all remember when the, the river flooded? That was a surprise. And the forest creatures had to climb higher in the trees or find higher ground. And this month in February, we got a new month, and one day it feels like spring, and the next day it feels like winter again. And this week we had a special day called Groundhog's Day, and that was on Tuesday. Does anybody know what a groundhog looks like? I gave you a hint with this book. A groundhog looks like a giant squirrel, and they live in burrows under the ground, and they sleep through the winters just like bears do. Well, boys and girls, you know what? We've got a song about groundhogs. That is a <coughs> Mr. Phil. Ready? Hang on. Listen in. Here's a little groundhog, furry and brown. He's popping up to look around. If he sees his shadow down in the six more weeks of winter. No, no, no. Can y'all try that with us? Let's see. Who, who's a good singer around here? Oh, right. We need all the help we can get. Catfish. I'll help you too. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Here's a little brown hog, furry and brown. He's popping up to look around. If he sees the shadow down here. Yes, yes, yes. Well, we have a new book at the library that tries 
us to answer the question about why it snows. Um, Meet Lumpy. He is a stuffed buffalo, and here is Stingray, an ocean creature with lots of imagination. And then here is Plastic, a ball who loves to read books. So look and listen as these toys meet snow in a new book by Emily Jenkins. All right, let's see what happens in our book. Lumpy is a stuffed <coughs> buffalo, Stingray is a plush Stingray, and Plastic is a rubber ball. She can't help it that that's her name. And it doesn't, it, she can't help it that her name doesn't match her body either. They all belong to the little girl. But little girl has gone away on a winter vacation. It is the first snowfall of the year. See the animals looking out the window? I'm the bull. <laughs> I'm the Why does it decide to snow? asked Lumpy. Because the clouds are sad and happy at the same time, said Stingray. She's more poet poetic than factual. <coughs> no, no, it, it's what rain becomes when the temperature is freezing, says Plastic. I read that in a book. Let's go out, says Slumpy. I'm curious. Yes, said Stingray. It's beautiful. Snow, 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 says Plastic Bouncing. I've read about it, but I've never touched it. I need a hat, said Lumpy. He is awfully cold. I need a plastic baggie, says Stingray. She's dry clean on me, you know. Poke some air holes in it for me. I don't need anything, says Plastic. She just goes naturally. And so, with no small amount of effort, in the 
the snow. It kind of looks like the sun, doesn't it? She. Inside the house is dry and warm. Outside, the tiny ballerinas have made a blanket of peace over the world. The strawberry syrup sun has gone down. And yes, the world is still sweet. Boys and girls, can you remember some things the toys did out in the snow? They looked at the trees and they uh, made snow angels. Can somebody tell me what else they did out in the snow? Yes, me. Thank you. 
came out here. It's been snowing for hours. Isn't it wonderful how the snowflakes float around? You can even catch them on your tongue. They don't taste too bad, but my mom says the flakes might have some germs. Oh, don't worry. I'm not tasting any. Besides, it's way too cold. It's all right. We don't see snow every day on the muddy bulky. Hey, we could try building a snowman. Let's go. Well, the hat and the scarf make you look great. That was the easy part. My back legs will hurt for days after rolling up all that snow. It's freezing out here. There's one more fun thing we can do while we're up here on this hill. Let's slide down. <laughs> Duck! Why would I want to do that when I could hop down slowly? Well, because it's fun. From up here on the top, it's like we can see the whole world below. Go on ahead, Freddie. You can go first. Oh, you can't be serious. No, nada. Uh-uh. Well, what if Fox went first? Oh, Fox! Felix Fox! Show Freddie how to slide down the hill. Mudcat? Yeah. You ready? Uh, 
All right, I want you to fill up this little dish half full of water. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Okay, then make another drop. Okay. Uh oh, that's a little too much. Oh, that was a All right, then you're going to measure out one cup full of instant snow powder. Now slowly, after you yeah, slow and you're slowly, you can cut the top off you. Yeah. All right, one half full, that's all. All right. All right, get ready to watch it come up. Okay, then you're going to slowly sprinkle the snow powder over that water.